so today we are going to learn about merge support remove all messages remove results and remove message in the previous session we learned about reprocess results and message and i let you explain how this works and the concept is very 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 similar to reprocess and the only good option we have here is like remove all messages and i let you know why don't we have reprocess all messages too yep let's start the session and we'll go to merge channel so here i created a very basic channel uh, with the channel reader and a destination as channel writer and one basic transformer which will change bit 5.1 to Sachin and now I'll change it to something like Kumble. perfect and I'll save the changes this is only for support purpose so I'm not explaining the channel configurations I'll go to dashboard and I already sent like multiple messages over here you can see if I search something with Sachin I'll get around 5 messages over here and if I won't search anything with this, I have around six messages over here. Now let uh, process multiple messages, and we'll try to troubleshoot things. Now I'll uh, click on send message, and I'll process it. The output should be with the name of Kumble. Now there are seven messages, and here uh, it has been encoded to Kumble. Now I'll select. Okay. Now let's go to the topic. There are around seven messages, one with Kumble, five with Sachin, and uh, the other with uh, no value. If I go back to the one of the message, there will be no value. Now let's uh, start working on these things. I want to remove only one message which has uh, Kumble in it. So what I'll do, I'll search it, and no, before that, I, I'll come with this particular thing remove only single message okay now we have the count of around seven I'll only remove single message I'll select any random message you can see when I click on this particular message I'll get an option of remove message but if I won't click on anything on any particular message or like uh, I'll go back and come back here I won't have remove message over here only remove all messages means everything has been selected if I only click on particular message, I'll get an option, remove message. So, this is nothing but removing the specific message. Removes a single connector message, not that removing a source connector, but only a single message. So, we will try to remove this. The count is 7. I'll click on remove and it's asking, are you sure you would like to remove the message? Yes. And even you need to make, we make sure removing a source message will remove all it from destination. For example, if you have the source and multiple destination, everywhere it will be removed. So it's not just on source or destination. Whatever you're clicking, this will come everything to this particular entity. This all uh, entity will be get removed. Okay. Now I'll click on remove message and click OK. That's it. One message has been related and we have the count of six. And as I said, we have the count of Sachin as five, or four. Nice, good. And Kumle as one perfect now we look into remove results as i said whatever we are going to search and uh, the output comes as results now i'll search with the name of sachin and click ok we got four messages now we have the option of remove results okay you need to be very cautious if i go to dashboard and come back again we you have the option of remove results because you don't have anything here in the search but you go already got the output even if you search with Sachin or Kumbli or any other name you already got the output and the results count is 6 so if you click on remove results everything will get removed so in real time scenarios I am going to search only specific message and I get the result of 4 and I'll click on this okay now I am going to click on remove results means only this particular 4 message will be removed and you will get the warning this will remove all results for the current search criteria Perfect means only for the current search criteria, not all the seven messages. Okay, I will click on OK, and to make sure we are doing it, uh, it will give an option. Sometimes we might click by mistake, so it always gives an option. This is actually a very good option. Uh, if uh, any junior or intern is learning, if he clicks it by mistake, uh, this option helps us him to read and make sure OK is not doing anything wrong. I click OK. Everything got removed and we have results as zero because we have the option of searching over here. I'll remove it and I'll search. Now 
we got the leftover two messages. Even in the dashboard, if you see, this is something uh, good which you need to learn. There are only two messages inside, but you have seven messages which are showing over here. So the difference between here is like these are the messages which are here, but here these are the statistics. So you shouldn't get confused with the statistics which are in the dashboard and the messages over here. The actual messages over here are given by the count. Okay, you have two messages. So in real time, if you have thousand messages over here, the statistics might be seeing like thousand two hundred or thousand five hundred. Means something has been done with this uh, particular stats. You can understand that channel uh, uh, dashboard. A uh, lot of messages have been deleted or refreshed or reprocessed multiple times. So even this will help you a lot. Now what we'll try to do? We'll go ahead and uh, click on remove all messages. This will remove all the messages which are already here. Okay, so you don't need to select any specific thing or anything. Auto automatically remove all messages will help you out. Include selected channels that are not stopped and everything. Yep, perfect. I'll select everything. Click OK. And again, uh, as we are not doing it uh, by mistake, Mirth will give an option. This is always a good and safe option. R E M O V E. Yep, perfect. Everything has been removed. Now, the results are zero. There are no messages over here. But still, the count. Oh, this option is amazing. Yep. Remove all message options, actually uh, even remove the stats over here. That's that's very good. And even I'll show you uh, another option, how to remove or clear the statistics. For example, I'll send one message over here. And yep, process this. Refresh. You can see the count over here. And even you can see there's one message. So there's an option in Mirth. If you are doing some testing and uh, there are a lot of errors and everything, uh, you want to do this is only for testing purpose, not for the production purpose. So you want to make sure uh, the count is a little e bit easy to count. You can right click on it and you can click on clear statistics, invert selection and click OK. The count will be automatically zero. It doesn't mean that the messages have been deleted over here. The messages are still over here. This is only for the uh, dashboard purpose. So that's how uh, you can remove a message, remove results and remove all messages. Then you might be asking in the previous session why there wasn't an option for uh, reprocess all results. Means generally never you will get an option to reprocess all messages. Means there will be no real time scenario to reprocess all messages. There is always uh, uh, a specific time uh, if the vendor hasn't received, the decision hasn't received. You only search for particular criteria and reprocess it and there are multiple criteria but not all the messages. In real time you will be having like 10,000 or like 1 lakh messages, you are not never going to reprocess it. That's the reason they never provided that option. That's how uh, re remove messages, results and this particular options works. And we'll be discussing more about uh, all other options in the next session. Thank you.